Hey, what's up? This is your boy ITYC here for another episode of Life from the Merch Shop. And I'm here chilling with the man himself, the carnival boss, Mr. Bagnall. Mr. Bagnall, how you doing? When I go just here chilling in the merch shop, and on the first time in the merch shop, just come in and cut myself a new hat. Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah! <laughs> so you like the vibes at the merch shop? Yeah, the vibes in the merch shop, nice, jiggy. I like, I like what the man doing. You know, just now I'm bringing some army walker shirt, some team Bagnall shirt, some carnival boss shirt. Uh-huh. I'm in the merch shop, yeah. Get the thing popping. Strictly business. For all the fans, them. Um. Okay, we're going to dive straight into it. You release your first single yeah. for the carnival, which is called Move. Mm-hmm. What was the inspiration behind the single? Well, inspiration behind the single was a voice from music festival. You don't know, on the stage, asking people to move. As a performer, you're supposed to be asking people to move. So instead of me asking them, I just walk up and me write a song where I'm singing it to them. You know, try to get them in the vibes, everybody move. We ain't come to no so come and act. We ain't come to no fit to stand up. So the tune is about getting everybody to move. So how how has the public been taking this new tune, Car Move? Well, um, it, it's been blowing up every day, all on the radio. I went on the bypass doing my exercise, cars passing. Whoa, yo, 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 yo. That's the line right there. So everybody has been gravitating to the tune well. You, you want to share a little light on the production work on the Move single? Ah, you don't know. Move song was done by the whole of team Bagnall. If you didn't know, Mr. Bagnall have a whole team. We have a producer, writers, dancers. Um, the man on this track, producer's this track was Stickle. We had Stickle. Stickle, you know, little. We had bass done by the man Lomax, Leon, and Macintosh. We had um, guitar by um, um, Ozzy. And the um, recording was done by Winch, DJ Winch, your banks, bank studio. Yeah, that's all the whole production on this move track. I, I feel you. So, when the public can hear the rest of the music that you got for the carnival, Sugar Man season? Well, for all who don't know, the carnival jingle was done by Mr. Bangal himself, along with Paige. Paige is this young lady playing a limitless band. Yeah, we did the carnival jingle. So, I'm called Sugar Man's Get Mad. Um, also done some other projects with. Um, Stick Lagan, our next um, producer out of Team Bagnall Camp. We have um, Andy Road, and we also have a next jingle with um, Don, me, and, and Pinocchio, you know, Pinocchio from People Show, with a jingle for Children Parade, going to be out shortly. Um, also, did some songs again with, again, I tell you, the camp is big. Have the man Paul Martin, not a national bank, um, did some songs again. So, all these things going to be done um, out by next week. Next week or week after next. So I don't know, Mr. Wagner will take it on a different level. You know, pull a whole team, whole waiting crew, production crew. Yeah, everything legit. I, I feel you. Um, I've noticed over the, the past three years, the music that you have put out, it don't sound like the average um, Kittishan Wilders, so to speak. Is that something you have done strategic? Well, I'm trying to look outside of St. Kitts. What these guys outside of St. Kitts is doing, well, we are not doing why are these guys making money and we are not making money? You okay? check? The thing is music here for me is like it's the only, um, you can only reach a certain way. So you got to now take a next step uh, to push your brand and to help push your thing is music. So by, by going in the next man's field and, and taking something from his style and adding his style, that's what I'm trying to do, just mix, mix everybody thing together and see if I can make a Mr. Bagnall product out of it with a different style. I, I, I feel you, I feel you. Um, I heard you made mention, and I, I have also seen some pictures of you and the young ladies, I guess it's in Team Bagnall, walking out. You want to tell us about that? For people who don't know, I don't see certain things. Yeah, well, uh, me and the girls, we already start working out for the whole carnival season, because this year is going to be a big year. We don't have a couple of gigs lined up, so we're going to be the whole Team Bagnall on every stage that we touch for the carnival. So right now, We've been hitting the bypass, we've been hitting the gym, and just getting ready. We we already been I'm practicing for soccer man for the power segment and we're not even in the finals as yet. So we don't practice. Yeah. You gotta be you gotta be on time, you gotta be early, you gotta be trip, you gotta be ready. And we're just getting ready. That's all like a check you just show. No, I just say you gotta be ready. <laughs> <laughs> I feel I feel I feel you under, I feel you under. So, you're not going in the Goovy Monarch this year? Yeah, we're going in the Goovy Monarch. I tell you, we have songs coming out next week. We're just supposed to pick which one we're going to use for the Goovy. We already have the power song, which is Move. We don't care who in here, but everybody got to move. 
Yeah. Oh, 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 okay. Let, let me let me let me ask you real quick, right? You got his new the new single, the Jack Hammer out right now, right? What, what, what's your thought on that? Man, Jack Hammer is a crazy tune. Jack Hammer is nothing like saying kids. It's, it's a most people may not know, but uh, we call it Boya Music, Dominica style. Yeah, yeah. that is crazy. I like the vocals. I like the beat. I think them guys, them guys did a, a brilliant production on this tune. I gotta give them um, props for that. So, um, would you tell? Anybody out there who coming into the soccer arena here in St. Kitts to go to Avenue? Well, uh, everybody got their own style, you know. Tell you, um, I tell you, see, whatever you prefer me to call it, as you know, but everybody got their own style. Is you, whatever style you prefer, or whatever style you like to hear. You know, me, I like the more down south, you know, Trini, St. Vincent music, so that's what I try to get my inspiration from. So, it's, it's up to you, it's whatever style you like, what kind of style you like, you like hip hop, you like whatever, you can mix hip hop with soccer, so it's you, whatever style you like. Okay, um, for the fans um, out there who might not know, could you tell us some of your past big hits? Big hits? Well, um, well, you know, ride up, most people know ride up, ride up, ride up, let me see you ride up. Yeah. And then we had walk up session, girl, 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 and you know, we had mash it up. Everybody bounce, mash it up, walk up on it. And you know, the big, 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 big signature again made the title on the Carnival Boss. I am the boss, Carnival Boss. Mm -hmm. And now this year we're going to hit them with the move. And we got Andy Road. Oh, yeah, we got Andy Road, Andy Road coming up next, sometime next week. The song will produce again by Stickle. A couple of men on the beat, like Nature B, um, I think Winch, a couple of other people on the beat. You know, the project. Yeah, so that one is going to be crazy as well. I, I feel you. Um, Tell us, a, tell us a little bit about your band life. Some, some maybe some people out there might know that you're playing the Collegium band. Okay, you want to give us a little light on that? What you want to know? Did I ask you want to know? I want to know how far the album reach. Well, right now the band is trying to free really, you know. As all the ladies been telling us to free really, so right now the guys them been working and freeing really. We want really free today. That's what's going on with the album. Break down the free really thing for me. Free really, the girl in one really. What's that? The road match, ah. the road match for collision. Ah, that's the road match contender right there. Nevis ladies want really free, Anguilla ladies want really free, whole Caribbean ladies want really free. So right now, we're just walking and freeing really. So when we're gonna get the collision album? Well, um, the collision is not doing an album. We're done with the album thing right now. We're just doing single tracks. Yeah. So Mr. Bagnell doing the single tracks. Trouble doing the single track, but they're gonna still come on though. Yeah. And the collision brand, if you understand what I mean. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna ask you a big question now. You do you in collision band, you're doing singles, Chubby is the next vocalist in collision band. Right? Would the collision band be taking the step and putting the music on iTunes? Well, we put our last our last album on iTunes, you can check it out. Yeah. Go on iTunes, type in collision band and you're gonna see the last year album come up. So, so you yeah, are leading the way yeah. in sync it? Yeah, I think you're late. You're late with the way. You need to find the way. <laughs> no, I know the way, yeah. I know the way, but the yeah. people out there might not know the way. Yeah, just check it out on iTunes, Collision Man album, the last year album on iTunes already. Done get a lot of hits, a lot of hits, a lot of, lot of dollar US <laughs> per track. So just check it out. Yeah, and just, you gotta support the thing, man. You gotta support the thing first to make it. You come with you guys out here all watching this. You, you right there in the blue shirt, you in that pink blouse. Yeah, it's you. They yeah, are support the thing one time. Last week, uh, let me not say last week, you performed at the floor launch. Yeah. Um, to me, it looked like it was that was a rehearsal for the so come on out. Really? What you say that? What you say was a rehearsal? How you delivered it, it, it look, and you sing um, your, your new tune, move and what's not. It looked like you were prepping for so come on out. Not really, we were just bringing the new tunes to the fans. And as you know, Flo, again, is a Mr. Bagnell sponsor, the whole team Bagnell sponsor. And we're just bringing the new tunes to the fans. That's basically it. I also performed um, the new tune again with Nitro. That's what Nitro released his song. And they put it lit, and I also came on up with him. And, you know, they shell it down, you know, when we touched it. When we touched down, we put shell down. So we just, we just did a good performance, yeah. I, I feel you. So, let me ask you. How did I get inspiration to come up with to come up with all these big hits? Man, sometimes I get voice from people. 
people on the street because you wouldn't believe carnival bus was made from people on the street they just walking in tongue and people would say last year was the man he was the man for the back and all he was the man for this and just take all them little words that everybody give me and just put them into a song all it move move just came from the voice of music festival then me and one of my producers Akai was vibing and he was like Man, something have to do something about move, get people into the moving vibe. You know what they come to do, but you know, and then just pull all that together and just come up with the song. I, I feel you, I feel you. Um, let me, let me ask you again. <laughs> yeah, we got we, we talk, we got yeah, a lot, we talk. we talking, we got a lot of different things here. Like right? the soccer scene, it look it look rather interesting this year. Do you see it coming bigger? So come on up from when I first entered. I think it's the same. You were there the same year as well. It grown. You have grown up to last year. The attendance was so big that I just feel I need to move from out of carnival. We need to go somewhere else. Probably football field or cricket, cricket pitch. You know, and from, la- from the first year when I entered to now, you see new faces. This year we got LAX. Last year we had mentioned um, who came in. And we have Lucas of um, and Ketty. Yeah. Probably Chubby gonna be there this year. So, you know, every year it's going, it's going every year. And I just wanna encourage more people to come here. Look, Sugar Bowl came last year and just win, so you don't know what can happen. Anybody could just come this year and just block, dig, get back on the licks with Sugar Bowl, let's get by the licks. So you just gotta take a, a try at the so come on up. And I was even thinking about taking a try at the Calypso. Mm-hmm. You know, I had a, a Calypso song there I was gonna go in, but. Can't take on too much burden right now, too much stress. So you know, just to say, I'm gonna stick with the soccer monarch and just let it flow. Okay. Um, you recently put an interesting post on Facebook where, where, where you said you're gonna invest in your own studio. Yeah. What made you write such posts? Um, I think studio is needed. I think here in Saint Kitts, we don't we don't take time to let we we music um go. I mean, in terms that we might put uh, record a song today and release it tomorrow. And we don't get we don't get time to cure. Like we record it today, listen it tomorrow, listen it next week, and then we might work out. So let's change this first. Let's add in this this cards here. So I feel guy might want to you know where we give me a better vibe to and create more exciting music and better music. I have time to change a verse, change a chorus, and you know, yeah, that's my time. Working on my time as well. So working on my time. I feel you, I feel you, I feel I definitely feel you now. Because sometimes you gotta just let the music sit. Yeah, you gotta let it sit. I'm better at it. Because I like now I really smooth. And it's like after hearing it so much, I'm be like, hey, this year could have been better. I could have changed this. Could have added this, you know? And even last year with Carnival Bass, I feel like if we had more time with Carnival Bass, it could have been an even better tune. But we ain't have our own studio. We don't know where to go pay for the time and what's not so. And so we go, what? Hopefully next year, by this time, Team Bagnall have their own studio. We could go in, burn with own oil, burn with own current, you know, burn with own lyrics, everything. So we're working into it for next year. Okay, so any book gigs as yet for the season? Well, yeah. Um, well, starting from starting from tomorrow, which is Friday, we have uh, the DFX launch. That's Ike and his wife, too. The next week, we got the, the launch at Inception, Mr. Bagnall there again. And then on the 29th of uh, November, we go over to Nevis for Awali Beach Festival. Mr. Um, we're going to be the whole team back now, we're going to be over there. And then we have uh, Inception again. And some other stuff. We don't know, we got the big soccer man up. Even though they ain't hire us, but we're going to be there. Don't know. Carnival Bass coming back for your title. So you don't know. That's how we have scheduled Salam. I, I feel you. Any last words? We don't know. Just want to tell the fans, them, everybody, we're here. In the merch shop, don't forget check it out every time here on the corner of Princess and Fort. Mr. Bagnall, look out for the West Tunes, them coming out, support all the artists, them. Don't forget we got the clothing line coming out just now, Team Bagnall, Army Walk here, Carnival Bass, so don't know we out. Well, folks, there you had it with the man, Mr. Bagnall, Carnival Boss, from live at the merch shop, or live from the merch shop, I must say. Let's get it correct. It's about I2IC signing out. One love. Peace.